Hello everyone, how are you today? So as you can see my small video clip, that's me boning out the silver side from the hind quarter beef. This is where this muscle is from, in the hind quarter beef, it's located in the hind quarter beef. Okay, so this is the muscle, this is the piece of meat that I'm going to demonstrate to you. So this is where suicide is located in the high quarter beef. So first of all, I have removed the silver skin from the suicide. Okay, it can be a bit of meat on it. You can use your knife just to remove the excess meat from the suicide. I don't know, but I, I find it a lot easier to use a steak knife to, to butcher this, this kind of meat, but on, on this muscle. Well, everyone's different, but it's totally up to you. Now I'm trimming any excess meat or excess fat. So this is the whole silver side. Now I'm separating it. So this other muscle is called eye round beef. Eye round. So now I'm continuously trimming any excess, ex, excess fat. So the remaining trim of this, the, main, the, the remaining trim then um, you can use it for mints or you can dice it up. Now I have removed that, that bone, that cartilage, that's basically from the hip bone, you don't want that on your meat. Like I said, three main things you must check, any excess fat, any crystal or any bone must be removed since I'm cutting it up for um, minute steaks I'm gonna basically move all these excess fat if it's for roast I'll leave the fat on because it's flavorable okay beautiful minute steaks show you how to cut it up for minute steaks beautiful look at that beautiful trimming slice it thinly sizes you know minute steaks is the reason why it's called minute steaks is Fries in the frying pan in one minute on each side. It also is used for sandwiches and and stir fry and also other quick and faster meal. So yeah, so um, that's why it's so thin and it fries in the frying pan really quickly. At least if you want it rare, medium rare, or well done, it's totally up to you. So the remaining scrap, you can dice it up, the trim, or you can mince it up, it's totally up to you. So the next muscle that, this is the silver side, I'm trimming up any excess fat. Any remaining crystal, same procedure. The suicide and eye round. It comes from the the outside of the rear leg, in sits between the top side and the knuckle. Yeah, so squaring up the ends, gonna cut it up across the grain. The importance of cutting it across the grain on these this tough piece of muscle, silver side, and also the minute steak or the eye round, is because it shortens up the vipers, so we so it won't be too chewy or too tough. And also it it moves a lot on this muscle, it walks. 
and it works and it moves a lot on this muscle that's why it's really tough yep so that's the tenderized machine i'm tenderizing the, the super side the beneficial of using a tenderized machine or whatever tools that you use to tenderize it is since it has so much connected tissue in the super side it just helps it just to break down the fibers and so it can be easier and to easier to eat to cut and easier to cook so it won't be too chewy or too tough so that's the beneficial of using or tenderizing a tough piece of meat so that's a tenderized steak look at that piece of fat gives an extra flavor to the steak so beautiful yeah yep and that's the advantage of using a tenderized machine machine just to help it to break down the fibers yeah so that's the tenderized and that's a demonstration of how to butcher and slice a tenderized silver side into tenderized steak iron into minute steak and dice and the leftover trim fulmins beautiful and that's the demonstration hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you next time goodbye